All right, and here we go. It's a time for another Boundary playthrough and Star Trek Online. It's just about ready to get, be uh, twilighted, which is a nice way of saying turned off. And we're going to do UFOP going overboard this time. So let's get it going here. I'm on my characters. I've got three other players that are going to go with me. Bad name Betty standing here to my left. And Yunin. And we got one more guy, Joe, is coming. I'm not sure. Did Joe join us yet? We'll find out here in a second. Beaming out. Got done doing a mission here with Bad Name Betty. Great one there. Alright, we're going to pick up the mission here. Oh, no, we don't have Joe. We got Joe. Where is Joe? Where do I go here? Grab our mission, Foundry, Browse All. Look for UFOP, United Federation of Pirates. Yar! That's our fleet. All right, uh, we're going to do going overboard. This mission does qualify for the standard foundry rewards. Wish we could do more there, but only one. All right, this is day two of the civil trial against Connie Dewitt and her band of pirates. The UFP prosecution presents evidence from a mission you were recently on to support Starfleet's indictments of using temporal technology for her personal gain. You're being called to the trial as a material witness. Explore this interactive biography, backstory, and history of the Orions and clan, Do It clan in its unique court case and biographic documentary. So we're going to take the main concourse door just below the transporter room at Earth Space Dock. And we'll head on over that way. I can't do this without... Uh, So, no. All right. So we're gonna uh, let me do that first. That's what I was afraid of on the cooldown. All right. So we're gonna have to. Why not turning? Moving it on. All right. Hold on a second. This is a. Uh, I have a technical difficulty here. Why am I not going anywhere? Oh, I am turning. But why am I turning like at two miles a second? Try that. That's really weird here. That's really strange. All right, where's Joe? Oh. I don't know what the hell is going on with my, um, uh, with my ship here. Like I don't have a engine or something on it. What the hell? This is the Enterprise. Why is it being so stupid? Come on, really? It's like doing nothing. All right, we're gonna change instances. I'll do it for that. Crazy, crazy start here. There we go. I don't know where the hell we are, but it's better than there we go. Oh, finally. Whew. All right, so we're on our way back to Seoul. I'm going to cool down. We're going to have to go there. Uh, the, we're slow boated that way. I can go a little bit faster. We can turn on transwarp, but uh, I'm going to take care of While we're doing that, we'll pick up the mission again. Try this all over again. Take two. Not every mission. We're going to be reviewing. UFOP going overboard. So I'm going to search for that. And here it is right here. Take this back. Oh, let's take a look at the, some of the reviews. Looks like I was doing... Looks like it was doing pretty good. You know, a couple of haters, whatever. 
but then the rest of it was was uh, definitely on a positive side there. Enjoyed it. At least the story wasn't as bad for this one. <laughs> Somebody must have done my first one. There wasn't much of a story there. It was, it's all it's just an interactive map. That's all. Hey, whatever. Uh, well, this one, uh, this guy went to start drinking. Didn't like it so much. Serving. I don't know why people really don't like these. But by and large, uh, it was different and funny and liked it. That's a, That pretty much sums up most of my stuff. Alright, let's get on to it here. Captain, we're getting a message across a Starfleet Command Priority Channel from the UFP First Circuit Court on a secure line. Hmm. Where have we heard that before? Alright, let's go ahead and accept this uh, message. There's Lieutenant Nish again. Yes, this is Admiral Kirk. What if I say no? Lead Admiral, please. I have no time for games. <laughs> this is a game. All right, and this is serious matter. Yes, I'm sorry. More serious. What is this all about, Lieutenant? This is Lieutenant Nish, a duly appointed officer for the Judge Advocate General, and you are summoned to court to testify. The matter of Starfleet versus Connie do it case D five seven dash zero four I two T zero. You are to report to Soul System Earth Space Dog Deck twenty two courtroom one o two. All right, know how to get to the courtroom, and we're almost there. There goes Wolf three five nine. So we are getting close. All right, fine, we'll be there soon. Enter the Soul System. Hopefully, it landed here. It should go on. Get to court. They don't like you when you're late to court. That's really a bad thing to do. All right, so. Gotta catch up on some uh, chat here. Goodness, saying something here. Uh, he's having trouble. All right, to the ESD. All right, Joe, fifteen, please. I'm gonna go ahead and dock. Get this team together, and we'll go to court here on Earth Space Dock. Put on a blue suit to go with my Tommy gun that I just got from First Contact Day. Check this out. Yeah, that's pretty bad. We're gonna go use this on some bad guys. And see how it turns out. All right, crew showing up. Oh, Betty and jo and Unit are there and ready to go. We just need to get Joe. All right, we're just waiting for Joe. But he's got the team lead here. He's uh, he's our captain. Maybe that's a better salute, huh? Here we are below the transporter pad, Earth space dock. Did a really good job on remaking Earth Space Dock. One of my foundry missions has the original Earth Space Dock in there. I have to go check that one out later. I'm not sure I've, I haven't recorded that one yet, but I plan on definitely recording that. And it's really good. Oh, there's Joe. Yay! All right, we are here. Uh, I gotta work. I, I gotta see if I can put on uh, an outfit that's more appropriate. I got something that's like officer material. I don't have a lot of officer material stuff here. No, well, this is it. This is, bet. This, is, this is as good as it gets for me. <laughs> right, yes, and we are recording here. Yes, we are recording. 
the recording. All right, Joe's on. Everybody's here. We're ready to go. The team is set. Let's do it. Just carry my bags. Go. You'll be fine. Alright, up here. And here's where it's gonna we're all gonna get split into eighteen into well it can't be eight. Into four different uh instances. The foundry has never been really good at getting everybody together. Especially at least on at least on my missions that I put together, um, and you don't send, you don't see a lot of people doing foundry missions together, which is probably the demise of most of my missions because most of my foundry missions were social missions in general, just uh, an interaction with the environment and the NPCs and some simple stress relieving kinds of uh, activities. Which are important, right? You know, a Starfleet officer who is under tremendous stress for long periods of time and needs to decompress. Important for everybody to do that at a point. So here we are. We have uh, the transporter has opened up, and we are now here uh, at uh, the UFP courtroom. Uh, that's here he's saying, "Sorry, sir, no running." And only those directly involved with the case before the court today are allowed into the courtroom. The rest of your team are welcome to view the proceedings in one of the conference rooms or remain here in the waiting area. Leave your away team here in the lobby. All right, so we'll see if we'll, uh, thank you. We will, by the way, for the Admiral. Lieutenant Nitch is waiting for you outside the courtroom behind me to confirm your ID, to be able to find him Pass the security check-in point. I suggest you, that you talk to as many people as you can to familiarize yourself with the history of the Dewitt family. One of Connie's sisters hasn't gone into the courtroom yet. You can find her over in the lobby waiting area. So there's a little bit of a mini game here. You can talk to the Dewitt family members and find the Easter eggs to unlock additional story content. I know, what do you mean mini game? So there are many things you can see and do in these interactive biography missions beyond the official quote-unquote storyline objectives. There are puzzles, there's dialogue kinds of things, just like in a regular Star Trek Online mission. Uh, mine aren't as fancy as theirs, but uh, I do what I can do. So there's a puzzle minigame like Erica's Diplomacy Negotiation or a combat one on the way team challenges. So you complete these successfully, the Easter rewarded Easter eggs, and un unlock additional content that can be used as evidence to either help or convict Connie do it. All right, have fun with them. All right, so you found the missing security. Oh, I see. <laughs> Somebody's already played this before. They already got the missing security key that was in a plant over here. All right, and so uh, I think we're done. We're We'll bring it no uh, no I think we'll hold on to it for now uh, no uh, I think I will think about it all right so there's a one of our security Easter eggs right there uh, look around all right I'm gonna move over to, through the courtroom here but it's uh Wait to see what's going. Go talk to Erica. All right, so I'm gonna send the crew over there to go talk to Erica and win the mini game for that. And I'm gonna come over here as the security checkpoint. The protocol officer. Whoa, whoa, whoa slow down there, slick. Huh? What? No food, drinks, or pets allowed in the courtroom. Please power down any tricorders and or refrain from using any such equipment while in court today or be subject to a contempt of court charges and a formal reprimand permanently placed on record. One last thing in protocol, sir. This is not a war zone, and as such, everyone in the courtroom is expected to dress appropriately. 
but I'm a non-combat outfit. Hey, I'm in a pinstripe suit. I look just like a lawyer. All right, uh, what's up with the bear? The bear, yeah, the one that's running around here. Boo boo, running around here somewhere. I was running around. Oh, you're talking about boo boo, yes. Connie's family is here to support her, and they thought they would be allowed into the courtroom. Not. Boo Boo and the rest of her clan are floating around here somewhere. Feel free to talk to them, but I would not get too close to the bear as I hear he is a bit of a stinky pervert and tends to bite males. Thanks for the tip. Alright, uh, and thanks for the reminder on clothing. No problem. That's what I'm here for. Please step forward into the courthouse where you are when you are ready. Lieutenant Nish is waiting for you just down the hall behind the security field to confirm your ID for court. So we're going to go meet him after we do our bio scan. We're going to come over here and do a bio scan. See the force field blocking us, and there's Lieutenant Nish right there on the other side. So we'll go ahead and run our bio scan. And we're going to go to the courtroom. All right. All right. I'll make sure I get to do the uh, stuff. And it's the same courtroom as in, you, if you're interested in seeing all the interaction available in the courtroom, go check out my other video for UFOP Do It Duty where I talk about everything that else is going on in here. So we're going to come on down here on this hall. The Amanda's still over there. You can talk to... I don't think I actually did t go into any of this guy last time I was on here. So he talks about who uh, Amanda is, and then we talked to her about uh, another aspect of the Orion, which is the space that they are from, which is from the uh, Triangle. The Orion, here is that you can get all sorts about free ports and who owns the Triangle. There was a lot of detail as to what um, what it was all about. You can find out now. That kind of good stuff. So, anyways. That's all on now. Thank you. All right, so we're going to the courtroom. Okay. My director of the courtroom here. All right, you got here just in time. The court proceedings are about to start. Prosecutors are presenting as evidence the official Starfleet mission log UFP NCC 17010-90324.4-F of USS Enterprise, my ship, under your command. Mission involved the Borg and rescuing Connie's sister Erica Dua from, the, from a boarding party. You are about to be called up to present your testimony at the witness podium that stands before the bench judges and the judge advocate. So we go to the witness podium in front of the judges. Go there now, thank you. All right. And here is our courtroom. There's Chop and his biography. And you should. And his reporter, Kestra, all the people that were out in the other one. There's there's Smurfette over there hanging out. Petra. And here's the judges. The judge advocate. Court. All right, so we're gonna go approach the witness podium. Raise your right hand. Do you swear that the testimony about to be presented is complete and accurate to the best of your knowledge? I do. For the record, you are James Kirk, the Admiral in and of the USS Enterprise. That is correct. Thank you for joining us, Fleet Admiral. Please take us back to Stardate 
9032.4.4. Tell us what happened that day after the Borg red alert in the Sirius sector near the likely system. The USS Enterprise was tracking several Borg ships that were trying to escape after the failed incursion. Start us at the point you warped into the lackey asteroid field. Computer playtime index 90324.46. This will start the mission log for our ship and our commander and our log. Let's start in playback. Confirm. Confirming we're starting our playback. All right. So now we're going to do that mission. See how that works? Pretty cool, huh? That playback is we're playing the actual playback to be played during the court case. Okay. Yeah, baby. Now we just have to wait for the uh, the load screen. This is where a good place to uh, have one of those refreshing beverages, a little Romulan ale, maybe. Whatever floats your boat. If something else is uh, floating, you can take care of that too, I guess. All right, there's four, there's five. All right, we are rocking. Playback's going. Uh, this is where I first started introducing sort of this um, concept of having a little status screen of what's going on, with being green alert. Our operations are ready, the shields are charged, our targeting and, and weapons are offline, and weapons are now we're charging. All right, there's the bad guys. We're to shut down complete, Captain. All systems nominal. We are on the fringe of the lackey system. Well done. All right, all my sensors are picking up Orion and yeah, hold on. All right, we'll let them kill him. You kill him. Uh, let's hail them. No response. Right. Who are those? Where are those Borg? Still nothing, sir. We're getting too much interference from the asteroids to pinpoint the locations yet. Yes, we moved to a, into the asteroid field for closer scans. Fine, we'll play it that way. No alert. Also, context confirmed. Yeah, they're all around me here. Shoot, die, you guys. Oh no, I'm gonna die. <laughs> I can't. All right. Oh, I'm not in the right one. All right, so here we go. Okay, I'll come to them. Here's where it splits us up. So, uh, thinking that my teammates right here with me taking care of all the bad guys, uh, it got blown up. Now we got to get us together here. Okay, who, so, all right, well, I'm going to be on. Okay. All right, looks like Joe's with, uh, probably with Betty. So it's going to be all out of here. Oh, this one has been so horrible to get through. Of course, I didn't have transwarp ability. And now we're going to do this again. Yeah. All right, let's try this again. Oh, yeah, no, we're... To we gotta go through the first map. Oh, that means we gotta load the first map too. Well, catch them up. We've been chasing the Borg and we're counting into this asteroid field, and the Ryans are here as well, attacking us. So, you know, hey, the Ryans are opportunists. So, if there's uh, somebody, you know. Two of, of you are fighting, and fight, get, get rid of you guys too. So we're going to confirm our playback, get started here. Hopefully we'll get that. 
more. Oh, that one's loaded much faster. Very good. All right, all right and we are all together. Woohoo! All right. So, that Orion Scout party that blew me up was killed by these guys. Uh, but the transmission was detected. We lost element of surprise, and Orion reinforcements are imminent. All right, we have to deal with the Orion Syndicate. So now we got to move into the find the board. Okay. Good. This is where I should have the Star Trek music play and turn all that stuff. All right, new contacts, Captain. Multiple Borg warships, warp signature detected. Target group Bravo assigned. Loading new threat packages for solutions. Destroy the Borg probe. Very well. We got friendly ships as well in the area, Captain. The Jamadar attack ship is Captain by Vice Admiral Connie. Do it. Hey, there she is. Uh, KDF records show that the uh, carrier is registered to the House of Dude and commanded by Amanda, uh, her sister. Oh, the unit's taking some heat. We're gonna get over there and help him out. Warning. All right, so uh, we need to secure this lackey system. Got these board probes over here. Target shields have failed. Get over here and help these guys. Not that they need any help. He was doing just fine all by himself over there. You know what I mean? Alright, but the idea of what behind this mission was these mobs will continue to grow larger. Um, yeah, so, make this one. But. It's out there. Oh, oh, we got some uh, fighters. I hate those fighters. Nice. All right, so we're taking out. We've got two of the Orion uh, trolls killed. Working on the third one here. Dylan's kicking some butt. Joe's right in there too. Bad name Betty. to blowing them up big time. Feel sorry for those Orions. They're uh, not going to be able to save Connie or Amanda. Alright, Scramble Syndicate. Easter egg. He put a heart on the Orion Syndicate. Yeah! Additional dialects have been unlocked. Okay, we have intercepted and decoded portions of a short scrambled signal sent from the last Orion Syndicate ship. The Orion Syndicate messaged. Message to Orion Malene, uh, decrypted. What did it say? Here's what we've been decrypted so far. Mission incomplete, Connie, negative scan, meta bacon and field frequency sent, hull breach, need help. Yeah, they got screwed. All right, I'll keep working on it. Captain, our victory has not gone unnoticed by the Orion Syndicate. Reading multiple warp signatures, I think they might have pissed them off. Probably. Ryan has significant presence in this area. They will not be stopped easily. You, We have the option to scan the anomaly and avoid further contact with the Syndicate. This is where the um, Esther Space build. Uh, test your spit your, against the Ryan Syndicate. Battle or readiness test? Yes. Yes, we can evaluate the strengths and weaknesses of our bridge officers and how combat hardening ship is by seeing how many waves of Orion Syndic pirates we can defeat. The Orion Syndicate, the Orion Frigate shouldn't be a problem, but the warship officers are all battle-hardened pirates. Good luck. The only good pirate is a dead pirate. Hey, 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 hey! What? All right, whatever. Looking on that one. All right, so uh, that was probably the first wave. Here comes the next wave. All right, let's kick some bass. Yar! All right. I'm gonna move up here a little bit. Help these bad boys out. Do my shit. A 
Love it that way. Throw these out. And did I do that? Alright, kicking them. Killing them. How's the team doing? The team's looking good. We seem to be having a whole lot of trouble. The Ryan Syndicate is no match for us. Yeah. Nice picture. Up to the next wave. I haven't played this guy in a long while. I should play Kirk more often. I have like 20 of them. Or to keep up with them. Grab wells. Don't stand a chance again to grab wells. That's how you do it, right there. Keep them all together. Bing, bada boom, they all die. Those taking a little bit. Jones doing good. Look, see how many, see how many each, get those things he's got going. That is the way you do it. Them up. That might be the third wave right there. I'm not sure. Great. I've been doing a. Uh, I've been doing a combat log. Damn, that was sort of dumb. Oh. All right. Congratulations. You have just moved to the top of my kill when I find time list. Ooh, Melina's not happy with us. Watch your buck. Uh, yeah, whatever. Nice job. Nice job, team. Alright, we got an anomaly over here and we need to go to contact the anomaly. Like a temporal distortion. Maybe they're right. Maybe kind of was doing something, huh? They don't distress call audio in a two any federation ship within range. This is the Captain Erica Dewitt of the USS Athena. Sending a general distress call. We have been boarded by the Borg and require immediate assistance. The boarding party has overrun our bridge and we are barricaded the, ourselves in one of the sick bays on deck three. Prepare team, we're going overboard. Captain, we have scanned the USS Athena and have Coordinates to the battle on deck three. We are ready to beam over, board the arena, and rescue the crew. Senior officers to the transport room. All right, and we're going to take, uh, we'll take Scotty. Well, they never stay in the same spot. All right, keep our fingers crossed that uh, we got uh, everybody in the same spot. That would be really nice. We will see. We get the loading screen. The loading screen of death for our foundry authors. Ugh. And, you know, it, it was really hard with this. I mean, it hats off to all the foundry authors that uh, took the time to place items, assets on their maps. It was not an easy thing to do, and it got, got to be so bad at the end. By the end, you couldn't even tell what you were placing. You just had to have faith that it was pointed to the right spot. All right, and of course, I'm not in the same one. So I'm going to go get the set to find out who's got to. Enemy targets on center. Personal shield losing power. Ooh. 
Ooh. Alright, so, uh, of course it split us completely out. Beam us out. Enemy targets on sensors. Personal shield losing power. Oh, I can't get out this way. Not yet. Flanking Turn damage here. detected. Really good. We gotta beam out and beam back in. And one more time. Uh, still not here. All right, just come first. All right, the Borg are hacking into our systems from the cargo bay and have shut down the security intruder control protocols. Get the security systems back online. We locked the doors from the outside to slow them down. You will find the door control at one end of the consoles in the hall. Be careful. Roger, we're already on it. That's the kind of covers in these crates found. Time to move on. I right, good, it sounds like they're finding stuff. Some salvage, some of that stuff. Oh, there she is. All right, good. We can start. Ooh. Okay.
right, so we have taken out back over control of the cargo bay where they keep trying to, to get back in. Putting down some. There you go. All right, we killed all the Borg. Yar! You put a hurting on the Borg and cheers. Cleared out all the infected crew. Thanks. Additional dialogues are unlocked now. All right. Okay, so then that takes care of that. Nice job, guys. So we're going to reboot. All right, so we rebooted it. We need to find Erica. All right, Captain Intruder Controls have rebooted, but I'm not sure how that last wave of Borg managed to beam after Enterprise to Kirk. Report here. Here, report. Sorry to interrupt, Captain, but I, I know another Borg sphere has warped into the combat area. They managed to beam another boarding party over before we were able to engage them. Their shields are up now. No longer being in any more drones over. We can handle them, sir. Keep my ship safe. Pardon? I'm not an ensign, sir. Scratch the pain and you will be. Captain, I recommend we leave the away team here in the cargo bay to guard and protect our exit. We'll secure the area, this area, while you find the crew. Leave away team in the cargo, okay? Do that. These crates have isolated trips in them. Good, thank you. All right, so they've been uh, they've been searching for stuff. All right, we are treating an injured crewman from the attack. It's safer in here. Come to the sick bay. How about unlocking the bulkhead? Come in, please. All right, so go. Yeah. Talk to Eileen overboard. This is Connie's mom. Eileen overboard. First time we see her. We have eliminated the Borg threat. Oh, wait, I gotta go over there. Alright, and that ends this part of the playback. End playback confirmed. Thank you for your accounting on this part of the mission, Fleet Admiral Kirk. Can you point out the captain of the Athena, Eric Duda, do it in the courtroom today? Right over there, Erica. All right, evidence, yes I can. Alright, I met some of the fan okay, so here where you submit evidence to the court, you can show your evidence. You've got none submitted. Okay, she is the captain, yes. Thank you. Uh I found some things. Found a security key. Yes, I still have it. Yes I did. Thank you. 
Uh, the Orion Syndicate was involved. Uh, they getting framed. There's other transmission. That was from Melina. Oh no, it was back. I must be. They are help. They are help. All right, so you do in all these things. All right, so this is the evidence that we're submitting. That's it. So we'll sh that's all we know. Thank you for cooperation in this case. Admiral Kirk, please remain before the court while the judges deliberate on your testimony and evidence. Wait for the judge to decide their testimony. Okay, so you can see the doing the testimony in back there. So the evidence, this is sort of like a picture into their minds. And the evidence, depending upon who did what, um, will determine who wins. So if, uh, you know, if the, so there was a, okay, that came out that, but no. Evidence rejected. The judge reviewed the testimony and evidence presented finds that the suspect circumstantial and hearsay. Yahoo! Yes, siree. Woohoo! Excuse me, Fleet Admiral. We will overlook your last comments. Contempt of court would not look good on your search record. This day in court goes to Connie. Do it. You are dismissed. Thank you. Oh, yes. Uh, I hope you're happy. I'm very happy. She's happy. We're all happy. All right, and that uh, wraps us up for another. I think that was it, right? What we got? Uh, return to the courthouse. Hey, right, all we gotta do is get out of here. We submitted our evidence for this court case, and it was decided today that uh, Connie, right here, is going to be like free. So, wave goodbye to her. Huh? What can I do that? That was goofy. Alright, so then we're gonna walk out. Why am I not walking? Alright, that's the end of this chapter. Connie's interactive bio. I hope you enjoyed it. I didn't I really enjoyed doing this. I wish I had done more of them. Um this was gonna be an ongoing story. I really liked how you played the mission that re they replayed here in court and then you wound up right back here in court, so that worked out really well, I thought. Um, here's my other goal, same kind of deal. Introduction to Orion, showing the dialogue types, showing custom maps, teaching negotiation skills. I really like All right, I'll let him know. Thank you so very much. I would like to give a big thank you again to all the Foundry Arthurs. You do a great job. Thanks.